Watch this and more only on Yippee.tv. Where are they? The day is already six hours old. Six hours! Wasted. What could be keeping them? The pharaoh should not be made to wait. Certainly not today, of all days. <gasps> ah, good morning, sire. Indeed it is. The sun god Ra shines even more brightly than usual. Today must be very special. You are correct as always. This is the day I get a clean litter box. Hmm. Special for you. Try being the one who cleans it sometime. Have your ears fallen off? I have been talking about this for weeks. Don't you know what day it is? Bad Tuesday? Good Friday? Silly Saturday. Super Bowl Sunday. Labor Day. Arbor Day. A day that shall live in infamy? An apple a day keeps the doctor away? Mm, Doors Day. I even marked it on my calendar to remind you. It is the beginning of Akhet, the lovely Nile's first seasonal flood. But more importantly, today is the anniversary of my coronation. Three thousand eight and a half years ago, I ascended to the throne of my father. Oh, not that anyone remembers. Ta-da! Fake out! We remember Tenstein. Happy Coronation Day! <gasps> well, this is totally unacceptable! <laughs> Tenstein? As Pharaoh, I want, I expect, a magnificent coronation party with gifts worthy of a king. <laughs> gifts like the jeweled headdress of Neferhotep, the pectoral of Sesostris III, or the royal walking staff of Ramses II. Yeah, I know all about the staff. My dad found it, remember? You didn't even know what it was until I told you. My dad said it was priceless, and it is, in more ways than one. Huh, precisely. So unless your cupcake is filled with gold and jewels, I would rather get something else. I deserve so much more. Yeah, like being ground up into guacamole. Leo! Have you posted all the flyers yet? Almost, just a few left. Don't you just love this poster? Tonight, Professor Horace Bedetti, master archaeologist, invites you to celebrate King Tutankhamun Setamun's coronation day. I can already smell those fat donation checks rolling in from happy patrons. Hmm, yeah, right. You wanna know what I smell? And once you finish the flyers, Cleo, you can help decorate. Then make sure all the refreshments have arrived. But I have to... Pick up my costume. But, but, I nearly but... forgot. So you'd better get moving. You have a million things to do. Yes, Professor. You know, I, I actually have a life. Luxor, go find Tut and keep him busy. Hmm? Sire, wait! A lavish celebration! A few extravagant gifts! Thousands of guests and well-wishers! Is that too much for me to ask? <laughs> for you, no. Uh, you always ask too much. I, uh, that is, I mean, of, of course not, oh, forgiving one. Come, Luxor. Perhaps a walk will cheer me up. If only there was a way to get back in 
sunset's evil graces. But how? Ah, I can't think when I'm hungry. Ooh, pretty. Another one of those weird whatchamacallits. A portal to the overworld! Yes! We can use it to find Toot Ogden Moon! Uh, oh? Our master wants that puny pharaoh's scepter of was more than anything! With it, he will be invincible! Uh, and if we bring it to set, he'll feed us a trail as good? Or rip us to shreds, depending on his mood. Uh, seems fair. Fearless one, uh, we've discussed this before. It isn't safe to be walking out in the open like this. You could be seen. I will be fine. I have Cleo's hoodie. Ah, yeah, quite dashing, sire. It takes a daring man to wear pink. I'll make sure I have it fumigated before we return it to Cleo. No one appreciates me, Luxor. I bet Ramses never had this problem. Why do my people not honor their pharaoh? Uh, maybe they're busy. Too busy for the one who severely punishes those who do not honor me and kiss my royal... <gasps> <gasps> Raging Ra! Do my dead eyes deceive me? Now, this is more like it. Roberta, how did your purse get down there anyway? Just get it. Nobody should be unhappy at my party. They should be joyous. I must fix this. Luxor, fetch. What? Dirty, smelly, wet. Oh, goody. on my purse. Dogs slobber, cats salivate. Ah! Hey, go on, get out of here! The ungratefulness. Oh, mm. the swelling. <coughs> what a ripoff! Ah, the perfect way to show my subjects how powerful their pharaoh is. Overseer, I wish to use my own mallet. Knock yourself out, kid. <laughs> we have a winner. Ah. Here, small one. This is for you. I didn't want a stupid bear. I wanted a dinosaur. <gasps> I don't understand, Luxor. Despite my best efforts, my subjects do not appreciate me. Hmm, I'm afraid, your obliviousness. Some people just don't know how to be grateful. Duh, obviously! Duck. Duck. Oh, sorry, ma'am. I mean, sir, all guests are supposed to go through the front entrance. Museum rules. Uh, thanks, Walter. Um, I'll show him the way. Oh, okay. <laughs> Whatever, man. Hey, nice costume. You even smell like a 3,000-year-old mummy, bro. I am not your bro. Oh, cool, man. <laughs> Whatever. Look, have fun at the party, bro. Party? What does he mean? And why are you dressed like that? You'll see. Not that you deserve it. Holy hot dog. On behalf of me and the museum, I'd like to propose a toast to King Tutonkin Setamun. Happy Coronation Day! Happy, Happy Coronation Day! <laughs> Most excellent! This is in my honor as it should be. Look, there's Anubis, Bess, Ma'at, Thoth! When did they arrive? <laughs> They're not the real thing, Tet. They're just guests in costume. They all came here today for the party I helped organize in your honor. So feel free to uh, express your appreciation. Greetings, God.
goddesses. Your pharaoh thanks you for your loyalty and adoration. Let me grace you with my magnificence. How you doing? You! How about gracing us with some air freshener? Gather round and let me tell you about the one we celebrate today. The greatest pharaoh of them all. Me. Typical. Tuck can't even take a second to thank me. Perhaps he plans to reward your magnanimous efforts after the party. Don't hold your breath. Oh, gotta go. I have hummus to serve. You can stick around with our moldy guest of honor. Cassin, <laughs> next time you want to eat a hippo for lunch, don't! <laughs> I didn't do nothing. <laughs> How about that? For once I scared someone besides myself. Yeah. Huh? Fool! We seek the Pharaoh, the one who thinks he is all that is. To Duncan Oh, uh, you mean the short dude in the smelly costume? Yeah, he's in there. <laughs> hey, man! Excellent costumes, bro! Totally authentic and junk. <laughs> Well, it's about time. I wondered when the hired help would arrive. Nice costumes. Now circulate the room. And no sampling the appetizers. Excellent punch. You should try some Luxor. It's like the nectar of the gods. Well, hello, Hathor. It's been a long, long time. You're looking very, very well. Hmm? Something is very pungent, and it's not the Pharaoh's fragrance. Oh, oh my. Oh, what a stench. I know that smell. It's so familiar. Demon feet! And so, you know, after I passed, they built a pyramid for me. For me alone, exclusively for me. So, we have party crashers? Not now, Luxor. I'm busy impressing my public. Bother somebody else. <laughs> the scepter of was. Grab it in the name of Set. Hey, hold up, guys. Hey, the section's closed. Not for us, false dog. Okay. Let's see some IDs. Driver's license, library cards, bus pass. <laughs> Wait, man! These aren't masks! <laughs> We've got the center of us! We got the center! We've got the center of us! Seven second! We've got the center of us! We got the center! No, they don't. I do. But, sire, they've taken the staff of Ramses. So what? It is powerless. No biggie. It's a big deal to Cleo. Her father found it, remember? She'll be devastated. But we've got to get it back. But what about my party? What about Cleo? Never better. Tip top. <laughs> what could be wrong? You look like you're in a rush to go somewhere. Yes, well, I do have an appointment. Hey, there are several appointments. Uh, gotta go. Go? I put on this whole party for you, and you're leaving already? <clears throat> uh, isn't there another uh, bigger way to go back to the underworld? Now! <laughs> I'll just wait here for you. Ah! 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 Ah!
Uh-oh. Bandit's boy and his cat are after us. Not for long. for me. <coughs> Pompous professor alert. Ah, another successful museum event. Thanks to my clever planning and supervision, of course. You do have a way, professor, of taking all the credit. Nice costumes. What is that infernal racket? to avoid work again, Jacobs. No, no, not at all, sir. Uh, two big, creepy monsters attacked me and I didn't know... Uh... Uh, Jacobs, next museum party, there'll be no punch for you. Indeed. Ah, this has been the best coronation party I've ever had. But there is one more thing that the Pharaoh demands. Now what? Cleo, Luxor, I command you both to go home and get a good night's rest. I will finish cleaning up here. We've got a big day tomorrow. Oh? What happens tomorrow, Master? We begin planning next year's coronation party. <sighs> I'll get more 
Bandages.